this is a 56 years old male and uh, he has been referred with the complaint of uh, incomplete evacuation of the urinary bladder. So, to see the prostate, when I move the probe downward and see the prostate, share with me with a 3.5 megahertz probe transabdominally that this is the prostate and this is the central black area is the prostatic urethra and here where the star is blinking you are seeing a tiny small tiny concretion which is giving posterior shadow yeah, yeah. Now this, the cause of uh, this gentleman urinary complaint, incomplete evacuation of the urinary bladder is this concretion that is seen in transverse section of the prostate in the prostatic urethra. Let's see it in the longitudinal view. Now you see again, there is a this is the longitudinal section of the prostate which I have magnified to show you the concretion. Now this is the prostate urethra. And here you see a tiny concretion within the prostate urethra. This is the prostatic urethra. This is the concretion, small concretion. This is the longitudinal section of the prostate gland. Now, the size of the prostate is normal. You see, this is the transverse section. And this is the longitudinal section of the prostate. Measurements. Calculated measurements show that that the prostate measures approximately 25 uh, grams and up to 40 uh, is considered to be normal. So uh, this is the prostate. This is the prostate gland in longitudinal section, and this is the prostate gland in transverse section. Well, this is the urinary bladder and you see that uh, the urinary bladder is normal, its walls are normal. This is the urinary bladder in transverse section. This is the longitudinal section of the image. This is the transverse section. This is the transverse section. So <coughs> now further we see that uh, just we have to see the urinary bladder is uh, clear of any calculi, any debris, uh, its walls are thin. So the urinary bladder is normal. Let's see his post-maturation residual volume after a while.